Happy Friday! It's Friday! So I am. Oh, I'm running through a yellow light. Oops. So I am on my way to Target. I don't care that it's raining and gray and disgusting. I have my rain jacket. Um, because I don't care. Because I want to be out of the house. <laughs> Let me out of that house. Like, oh my God. <sighs> It's been a trying week. I was trying to figure out, like, why is this week so hard? Like, why is it such a difficult week? Um, difficult cases, difficult customers, just difficult, difficult, difficult. But that's because, baby, next week I work till Wednesday, okay? I work a half day on Wednesday, and I won't see those people until December, okay? So, that's why. Uh, they gotta get their money's worth out of me. They gotta squeeze a drop of blood out of a penny because I won't be back. Okay? <sighs> and then when I come back, I'm gonna work for two weeks and I'm gonna take off my birthday. So it's just like, this is my time of year where I'm barely at the, at the job, for real. So, thank God for that. But anyways, I'm free. I'm off, y'all. The kids was out of school for Veterans Day. It's just like, <laughs> I don't know what it is. Like, I, me and Ivy, me and Ivy have a schedule. You know what I'm saying? Like, we have a schedule. We have a routine. And, like, it don't matter if it's the kids or Alex. Like, if somebody says something, it just disrupts everything. And, like, they was disrupting her nap time. Acting like they can't sit down. So, I had to I had, I had to make them up some work to do. Like, I had to go in the, in the closet and get them some worksheets. Because they act like they couldn't just relax and watch TV in color. Like, I mean, it's just... Well, now I got to find you something to do. So, I had to find them something to do. Then, I had, then they act like they still couldn't do it. So I'm just like, okay, you got some energy to clean up your bathroom because it's disgusting. Clean that, you know? Then they didn't clean it right, so they have to clean it again. So it's just like, I don't know. It's just, it's, it's a lot having all three kids all day long. That is crazy. Um, homeschool, like, child please. I'm talking about I'm considering it. Child, whatever. Basically trying to decide right now if I want to, uh, go down to Starbucks and get a drink or if I want to go get a drink from the Starbucks in Target. I just don't like talking to people. Like, <laughs> please don't talk to me. I don't know. I guess I'm just going to go to the Starbucks in the Target because that's what makes the most sense. But like the there's a part of me right now that, that is not wanting to do that. But I'm going to do it. So I'm going to go to the Target and then we're going to look. I have a list so I don't forget anything. Um, but I want to find like some, I feel like Target would have this. Like I want some like cutesy, like pink Christmas stuff to decorate my office slash studio. Y'all know I work in there, in that room. I film in that room. I chill in that room. Like, I mean, well, come on then if you're going to come. Come on. Come on. Are you coming? No. Okay. Tried to let you come over. So I don't know. But anyways, um, I need to, I need to get some stuff. So that's what I will be looking at. I want to look in like the, what is it? Like the $5 section. Um, you know, cutesy little like things like that. I'm going to Target. So excuse me. But, um, and there's some other things that I need to pick up. Like some little knickknack things. There's a lot of people at Target. Alex uh just teased me saying like let's go get the christmas tree then he acting like well we'll be doing it again i'm just like you know what if you don't want to do it don't say anything we'll go tomorrow because i had it in my mind that we was gonna go tomorrow anyway so yeah and then he said that he bought the girls some mcdonald's so they had mcdonald's he ate mcdonald's so i can just fend for myself y'all don't understand when a mom out here you're you're never able to just fend for yourself if you do you're more than likely gonna forget to feed yourself honestly so the fact that like i can do whatever i want for dinner whatever i want whatever my heart desires that made me happy and i'm feeling like i might go to like my favorite sushi spot that's like right here it's like a little hole in the wall i might just should have brought my bible but i might just go over there and do some real nice chilling and eat in the restaurant alone quiet because uh, I need caffeine. My head is pounding. Like pounding. 
Maybe I'll get tired and go over there. These are such cute little things. Like houses. Like a desk. All right, y'all. I made it back home from Target, and I went to get sushi for dinner, but I couldn't really eat it because I had such a bad headache. But here I am. I gotta show y'all what I got from Target, and I gotta show y'all some stuff that I got from Ross because I'm gonna redo. Well, not redo, but like you know, do a little home edit. In the laundry room i cleaned it out really good and bought some things to kind of you know make it new to me i also bought christmas cookies the kids just asked me to bake them so i had to get off the sofa put on my mom hat but really me and Ava was watching this virgin so Let's bake some cookies. This kitchen isn't giving. Five little ducks went out one day. No further than ever. So I got a Christmas tree tomorrow? Yeah. Or well, a new one? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 Mm, should we just go ahead and bake all of them? Target haul. They had a bunch of cute little like office stuff. I want to do can't see me i want to do the backdrop in my office basically so when i make the videos it's christmas in the background and the little dollar inexpensive section had good cute stuff like i got this cute little sparkly tree it is pink my favorite color it's pink me and little have the same favorite color three dollars just for that it looks beautiful and then this one was three dollars is a lit glass tree and it does light Ooh, up so i thought that would be cute in the background and then i also got this cute little i don't know if it's a house i guess it's a house they had another one that was like long but it's like iridescent really cute i wish my background was the way i don't know i miss my background when the girls is before we i switched room with the girls is because I feel like you can see the backdrop like better in a way because of how the room was shaped and like now with the way my desk is, I don't know. I feel like I would have to sit on the sofa and film for you to really see it, but you can see it a little bit in the background. It's just really far away it seems, so I don't know. So I thought the more stuff I got, maybe the better you will be able to see that it's Christmas. So we're gonna decorate that yeah and then i got these cute little ceramic nutcrackers they were a dollar each so i'm gonna put these like every which away and also i wanted to do let's just finish this um so i got that these are the clothes and then i also got mm -hmm. this cute little like pink tree that came with its own ornaments this was five dollars and i thought this would be cute 
I think I'm gonna put this one like on my work desk or whatever and then put this one on the backdrop with like a you know like a little Christmas scene and I hope it comes to life right um I got these these are so cute these little gingerbread um towels I bought towels that's gonna be in my Christmas collective haul other than this cute little spatula that would be cute for me and the girls to like I don't know we always do some type of baking activity so I thought that'd be cute. Probably should have bought two, but oh well. I needed some feminine wipes. And then they also had some cute tops for a good price. So I bought a white, this is a new day. So I bought a white, just basic shirt. This was like 12, yeah, 12. And then I bought, a brown one because you gotta have the neutrals and white is probably gonna get stained let's be honest with the baby so i bought a tan one to match like my i'm gonna wear all this with looks probably and i have those reebok too those are really neutral and cute and then they have this really cute um bodysuit and i got a 2x but this is cute and comfy. Like it's like a ribbed material, kind of the same as the tops. Like the tops kind of give a skin vibe and the neck is like a, a square scoop neck. I've never seen that. So I thought that'd be really cute, especially y'all know I like to do my necklace stacks and keep my wardrobe pretty simple. So I just got some basics because I have, you know, that jacket that I got from Costco that has like the gray, the tan, and the white in there. So I just thought all this would just, if as long as everything's like black, white, or neutral, like tan, I feel like all my stuff could like go together. Um, so I'm just keeping it in that family because it's just easier. So um, yeah, that's what I got from the Target. We'll probably reset the office if I have the strength tonight. I already showered and everything. I showered on my break. But, um, yeah, I guess after I, you know, chill with the kids for a minute, we'll probably go in the office and decorate. But I also want to show y'all what I got from Ross. Okay. And just a few things I got from Ross. I'm not showing everything because I'm going to do a collective Christmas haul video that's not going to go up to December 1st, I think. So, this is just the things that's not pertaining to Christmas. So... I found the viral bling brushes, y'all. The makeup brushes that for $5. These were $5.99. How pretty are these? And these are by Macbeth Collection. And it's the Fabulous Face Brush Set. These are really nice. It tells you what they are on the back. And then I also just picked up a cute pair of like Kate Spade socks. These were three for $9.99. And they're really cute. This is design on the back. And then I already got my planner. This is a 2024 planner for $7.99. Um, has the cute little format right here. I was on the phone with my pants when I was in there. And I was like, I might as well just go ahead and get me a planner because I want to get my life together. They were laughing. So that's how it looks on the inside. It's real cute. Like this is January. It says remember why you started. Just real cute. This one doesn't have stickers, but I'll probably buy stickers February. Let's skip to September. September. So it's like a floral type of planner. Is there a note section in here? I guess each month has notes. Oh, look at the breakdown, y'all, for the weekly. So cute. So cute. I think I'm gonna have a is a folder okay yeah it each each month has notes in the back and then it has like a little pocket where you can keep you know receipts or whatever you need so and i like the size of this one it's like not too small and it's not too big because i like to carry it in my tote bag with me and then final thing i can show you is this cute rug this is the artisan um rugs this one is was 9.99 it's not as long as the runner in the hallway, but this is the same brand as the runner that we bought a while ago to put in the hallway. This one's black and cream. 
And I'm gonna put it in the laundry room because I'm doing like black accents in the laundry room because y'all will see, but I ordered some stuff from Amazon that's super cute that we're gonna tackle this weekend as well. I kinda wanna do that, but Alex has to put the cabinet together because I'm not a, I'm not a DIY girl. Like if it ain't put together, I ain't putting it together. like a new rug so I have blue rugs everything's just kind of mix matchy and I just kind of don't want that vibe anymore so I'm just trying to make it cohesive because you know you have a house you know you just repurpose things without thinking it through you just stick it in there so so basically I'm just trying to make it aesthetic in the laundry room so i want to do the black accents on the wash put the new rug down i have this cute little cabinet thing that's black with wood on it and i was talking to my co-worker she was like why do you sweep and mop every day i'm like because this baby i have to she's everywhere <laughs> y'all alex can put my <laughs> I'm glad they gave me two of them. Because uh, he ain't even peel, peel it. He's just uh, ain't supposed to be smooth like Lily said. Lily had to tell us how to do it. And then we're supposed to transfer it like a like a tattoo. Okay. It's good. Right. Baby, why you letting it just flip? <laughs> <laughs> Why are you letting it flip and flop? A little smooth it out, cause your daddy he just he rushing it. Make sure y'all get it where all them ridges at, Lily, where he got the ridges at. It's supposed to be smooth. You just need the black to stay on. Right, right, right. Hold on. Gotta go slow. Mm These we didn't have these washing dries a thousand years, so I'm just trying to spruce it up. Okay, but really, this is not. I wouldn't recommend. I'm gonna link it, but I wouldn't recommend because you have to go a long way about it. It's not like just ready to peel and stick. You gotta. You, you have this, then you have to put the adhesive paper on top peel it up then stick it down again and it's just like we have come so far that we shouldn't have to do all of that so we finna do the dry part yeah linda was the one that knew she was like no nah, you're gonna have to i'm looking at it. i'm trying to explain to alex you knew what i was saying though right yeah because yeah, i was trying to explain to alex what i was saying like it should be ready to go and he was like you bought the wrong kind and i'm like what and Lil was like no you're gonna have to Peel it up and then stick it. Okay, here, take this off. But y'all see, like, there's a way where they could have just had this ready where I could peel it up and then go. I need this part. It's not as easy as you think. <laughs> it was not. It is gonna be easy with my assistant. 
<laughs> okay, Lily, you grab this side. Okay. And I'm gonna grab this side. You're gonna put yours on the ends of your pieces, your, your corners. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna put mine on the corner, on my pieces of my corner. Okay. Me and Lily did. <laughs> See, baby, look, me and Lily, we did, we did, uh, we did a little bit better than you did. <laughs> Yours all crumpled up in the middle and everything. All right. I think we got everything. And so now we got to You see what I'm saying? Because, like, it don't pick up every. The way it's supposed to. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. You hold the bottom up. Okay. So that, hold the bottom of it. So that I can, but don't stick it. I'm going to stick it, okay? Okay. But hold on. Maybe I should just. I'm trying to see. <laughs> you gotta get back. <laughs> Damn it! Okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's up, so. yeah, it's Thank you. Alright, y'all. So, this is how they look i mean for six dollars okay i'm not gonna complain ignore ivy's laundry but yeah all right so here's the rug which is the artisan rug for ten dollars i just feel like super cute i was hoping dang i was hoping it was long enough to go in front of both but I guess this will just have to to do. Cause it's like, like, you see, it's like in the middle. I kind of want one that'll go all the way across, but this will do. And then I moved the laundry sign over here. Y'all look at the cute little nutcracker bag with all the, with the black nutcrackers. I got that from Marshalls in Birmingham. So I put the laundry sign over here and we're just gonna use it to put like our keys on and the reusable grocery bags. Um, so yeah, this is a cute little, I mean, update. It is what it is, it's cheap, but it's something to spruce it up. And then the little cabinet that I bought is gonna go right here in this corner. So I will give y'all an update once Alex does it. So yeah. Um, am I gonna do an office reset? Probably. I'm gonna do an office reset. <laughs> this is how the little folding table looks in here. In the wash. Mm. 
The cookies are well done, like way more done than I like them. I like them more so on the raw side. These are like cooked. Super tiny on the. <laughs> <laughs> well, we figured it out. So, yeah, my phone is just bugging out. Like it don't want me to. It don't want me to film. It don't want me to keep anything. It's just doing the most. I don't know where I'm gonna put this candle, but I'm gonna pop the tree open. y'all can y'all see the tree so that's what i'm gonna do to it for now i feel like she needs like a little bow i'm gonna save some for if i lose some <laughs> am i just saying that because my knees hurt and i just want to get up yes but also it does sound true like i should save some just in case you know some get lost i know so i don't know if i want to put her like here you know, like there. Uh huh. And then, I don't know, I just feel like maybe I should pull one of these up here. Yeah. Anywho. Anywho, anyway. Uh, I'm gonna pull one up in my bra right here. There we go. Okay. So, let's see. I think I wanna do. The little house and I wanna do some nutcracker men like maybe here and then maybe I don't know maybe here can you see him okay and then I think I'm gonna put these somewhere else and then keep the M I don't know what to do with my candle I just think that I'm not gonna have a candle moment right now to just leave it I feel like he's not showing enough to keep right here I'm gonna put him somewhere else so this is potentially what you should see in the backdrop let's test it out because I'm usually sitting here. Let's see. Let's see what I see. Y'all, this content creation ain't for the week. Can you see them? Can you see the Christmas? I feel like I'm struggling. Because in a perfect world, I would be talking and can you see the tree? Feel like you can, but not as much as I would like. I don't know. I guess like when I'm doing my like my haul videos, I can sit like closer, you know, and where this where I'm sitting here, and then you just see it. Cause otherwise, you're just not gonna see it from the desk. Um, so let's. I just gave her a wipe down, trying to see where. Thought I was gonna be able to stick it up here, but maybe I'll be able to, cause I think it's gonna block my view while I'm working. Maybe I'll put it here, and then, and I did like a little nutcracker 
tree moment here on my desk so that when I'm working, I'll be there and I can turn it on or whatever. And then this is a little ghost Lily made me. It says, mistakes are proof that you are trying. How sweet is that? Like she just left that up there for me to like find. So that's cute. Um, Don't know what I'm gonna do with her. Good, and I put the little pink one in my bathroom just with my Among the Clouds, clouds candle. Um, so yeah, I feel like that's cute. And I think I'm gonna make some shorts like right here. Probably gonna slide this down and just um, film like the unboxings like with that in the background. Um, that's probably gonna have to happen tomorrow because my phone's dead. So this is all for now, people. This is all for now. I still have the zip sticker. I hope that it's ready to peel off. I don't know. I use these and I don't pop them in. Like it's like I still mark. So, um, okay, you guys. I thought that we could do skincare together because I haven't done my skincare for tonight. I get these these huge like square pads from um. And I wash my face in the shower, but um, this is my toner. This is the Dear Hydration. I've been using this and only this. I just noticed that, like, when you're doing skincare products, it's best to just not accumulate a whole bunch of them. You know, I do like this one. I think I found this one at TJ Maxx. And I just go with my whole face. I'm on my cycle, so I do have some strays. Some stray pimples. Okay, so I just toned. And then, oh my gosh, I'm almost out of my essence. This is the Philosophy Essence. Uh, purity Essence. Like, oh, I'm almost out of it. And I'm kind of scared. Because I don't know what else I want to try. And I found this at TJ Maxx for $7.99. So, you know what I mean? Like, it's just kind of like, I don't know what else I want to try. Y'all are sitting on my skincare fridge. <laughs> so, I'm sorry not to disturb you. But I'm going to go in with the Hyaluronic Acid by The Ordinary. And, like, y'all, my skin is the best it's been in a while. Like, the only time I have pimples is when I'm on my period which is really nice but i'm saying it also to say like i've had really simple skincare steps you know like, i've just been sticking to one product not switching it out um you know i need to take this bracelet off and then i'm gonna go in with my new charlotte tilbury magic cream this one's so expensive, so I really want I really want this to wow me. It's like whipped almost. It's not as heavy as the It Cosmetics cream. And I guess I need to get like stop comparing them. It's just hard not to compare them because that's the only like nighttime moisturizer that I use, you know? But it's nice. And the Charlotte Tilbury has a glow to it. Like, I don't know, like a built-in glow that I kind of have to manufacture with the, um, I'm gonna go with my Dior lip plumper. Today in Target, I was looking for the Elf lip oils, didn't have them. And then one last step is eye cream i'm still using the origins um refreshing eye cream brighten and deep of cream i do like this like eye cream is one of those things that like you feel like you have forever but you literally can see it like leaving like i still have a lot but like not really and i just like to do 
a little bit of like two layers. I honestly probably should do some under eye patches this weekend and a mask. But that's my skincare. And then I top it off with the e.l.f. Uh, what is this? Facial oil mist. Y'all, Alex loves fresh skin. Like every time like my skincare is like freshly done, he's always like, you're so pretty. <laughs> it's funny. I'm gonna wash my hands. But that is my skincare routine. Can y'all see the Christmas tree? Like I hope y'all can. Because she's adorable. Love her. You guys, real quick, this new holiday treat, cinnamon pumpkin pie. Woo, it's so freaking good. I even got the body wash. Y'all, it smells so good. Like, it's way better than the tree hut, uh, what's it called? The tree hut um, pumpkin spice. Cause that ain't spicy, it's like gourmand. It's like, this is pumpkin sweet pie, okay? We ain't spicy around here, we just straight up sweet. And um, I'm gonna go outside, y'all. So I don't know what I want to put on my feet. I honestly just want to wear flip flops. I mean, it's 67 degrees. I feel like I need to cover my toes. That's what I need. I need like some mules, like some slip on, like shoes. But um, and then my scent is the Billie Eilish and then the Warm Vanilla by Pink. And I've been using the basic vanilla instead of the warm vanilla. I'm probably going to gift that to somebody for Christmas because I got too much stuff. So, I'm going to do a layering video. But y'all always get tea first because y'all the vlog. We doing life together. I'm going to put on just some cute little earrings. And lay Ivy down and get out of our room because she ready to take a nap. I really just want to wear flip flops. Excuse my mess, but this is the outfit. I'm just going to wear these platform vans and this dress i want to say this dress is from fashion nova from my fashion nova era i mean i look fat but i'm fat and on, on my way out so <laughs> we're outside so we're about to go to dollar tree and dollar general um dollar tree i want to see like what kind of like christmas uh knickknacks they have because the girls were like obsessed with like the pink christmas tree and stuff i got from target and they kind of wanted like a little touch of something in their bathroom. So I said I would look in Dollar Tree to see if they have some stuff because um, I don't know. I didn't think they cared, honestly. So I'm going to see if I can find them something. Still very gloomy, y'all. I love this kind of weather. I love gloomy, cozy weather. So cute. Um, but anyways. So going to Dollar Tree. Oh, and I want to see if they have like some oven mitts and just like some just different Christmas things, you know, just Christmas things. 
and then we're going to dollar general i need detergent and i have a list so like i need just a few things from the food side from the um laundry side just some stuff so i can't remember why i didn't like these vans they rub my i don't like to wear socks and like they rub against my foot really bad y'all look what i found it's the starbucks I say refresher. Who would have thought Dollar General would have it? It looks like, like milky in there. Mm. <laughs> mm, I don't know. I mean, it's trying to be a pink drink. It's like yeah it's like um it's trying to be a pink drink it's not as like refreshing it's like you can tell that like it's table sugar in that and some something like it gives like powder coconut milk or something you know what i mean like it just gives like shelf life pink drink not like freshly made pink drink so but it's good it's sweet it's creamy it's strawberry I don't know if I would buy um, any more for $3. I have three more because I bought three because I just hadn't seen any and I knew I was gonna drink one. And yeah, so it's good. It's good. I mean, it'll do. I, it kept me from going to Starbucks. I'm not going to Starbucks, so. All right, I'm gonna show y'all what I bought from the dollar store and Dollar Tree. Uh, so. This is the pink drinks I told y'all about three of those. So that's that. I also bought the cranberry sprites, the limited edition. You know, this come out every year for Christmas. Y'all, you gotta, y'all be talking about stuff they don't feel like Christmas. You gotta buy the stuff to make it Christmas. You gotta pull your decorations out. Right, Liv? Yeah. You gotta pull out your decorations. You gotta buy the limited edition sprites. You know what I'm saying? Like you gotta make it feel like Christmas like otherwise yeah like nobody you're not you're, you don't live with your mom you know you don't live with your mom anymore so like if you don't make it Christmas I'm talking about for the people who don't have kids because people who have kids I think we just go ahead and make it Christmas because of the kids but like even when my kids are gonna be gone like I'm gonna go ahead and make it Christmas you know do the little vibes but anyways fabric softener spring daydream this is my favorite it smells so mm, it smells so good then I bought the Balance. This is the crisp rain and blue eucalyptus. I bought this one pretty much for Alex because the spring daydream is pretty feminine. I mean, he doesn't care to put on his snuggles, but I don't know. I just used the clean scents for him. And then I bought the Balance uh, scent boosters and then the spring daydream scent boosters. I still have a few of those left, but I'm completely out of these. Um, And then I bought the sunrise bliss this is my favorite detergent it smells so good they don't make this one in the in the big handle oh my, so they don't make this one in a big handle so is that everything yeah oh and i found ivy her own little stocking for her a disney princess one it was five dollars so i got her her own little stocking and then i just got some snacks i bought pretzels for me and Alex and the dipped animal crackers for the girl and I think that's it and then I got barbecue sauce for um pulled pork sandwiches so I'm gonna put this up and then I'm gonna show you what I got from Dollar Tree all right Dollar Tree bought some Christmas things y'all know I love me a farmhouse pickup truck so I got that got the matching one got the girl some loofahs clean or sponges what you want to call them bought these little organizers for the bathroom so that i don't know i don't know so they can keep up with their stuff because in the morning time it's just it's not giving everybody gotta reach everywhere and they share deodorant you know i bought two deodorants i just don't understand so I'm trying this again where everybody has their own respective things so they can put away 
And they just throw their toothbrushes in the drawer. So I'm just like, where's the cover that came with? Because I always buy them toothbrushes with covers on it, but nobody's toothbrush is covered. So, I bought two things, two bars of zest, two packs, so it's like four. Because they go through soap. I told y'all how they go through soap. But I bought them two more of the pink lemonade body washes, too. Um, new toothbrushes with covers. We'll see how long that lasts. Got them some of the Teen Spirit Ladies Pink Crush deodorant. They both need deodorant. And then I got all of us, me, the, me and them, some of this Colgate Mint Fusion Knockout. It's time out for the kitty toothpaste because they need whitening and everything at this point. So, no more kitty toothpaste. And then, I also got this little pickup truck. How cute is that? I thought this would be like a cute little, a cute little like spoon rest in the kitchen. And then, I don't know, I think I wanna retire those little wall things over there and put these ones up because I think they're just so cute. Can y'all see them? With the plaid, it just kind of matches everything. And I think that's it. Oh, and then I found something for their bathroom. Found this cute little like Whoville tree. It already had the ornaments on it. And then this pink little tin that I'm just gonna, you know, just put it up on their bathroom to make the Christmas in there. And then I also found these string lights and I'm gonna see if I can Bring the lights in their room, like decorate their beds or whatever. And finally, um, if their room is clean, let them put their new comforters on there. Okay. So that'll be another little project for today. And that's it. All right, y'all, this is how the little Christmas looks in their bathroom. I'm still burning the first wood orchard. I kind of like for it to be open, but those slits went everywhere. So it's not as pretty. And then this is how I just put their little, you know, I put their little things on the counter. I don't know if y'all remember this, but I bought this bath mat from Walmart that I'm gonna put in the bottom of their tub to maybe help from, I don't know, I'll be feeling like I hear their butts scrubbing the bottom of the tub. <laughs> <laughs> is that your butt I hear? <laughs> oh, okay. So we put the little mat in the tub and then this is how their little caddies are. That's lilies with the pink and that's roses with the purple. And I gave them a soap and a body wash each. So their bathroom is restocked. This is their bed. How this having a fit? These are the little rainbow lights. I can't show y'all the rest of the room because it's a mess, but it's cute. You like it? And this is Rose's bed. It turned out really cute. And these are her little lights. She has like the little stars. Show freaking advent calendar. Wow. Oh my gosh, y'all, it's so beautiful. It says it retails for $195 and the value is $250. And I actually got it 40% off because they were doing something 40% off full price items. So I splurged and I got my very first advent calendar. Oh my gosh, look. And so this one's only like 12 days of Christmas. So I'm gonna save it for December and we'll do, we'll pick like one every day basically and we'll open it together. I'm not gonna do like a review where you see everything. So yeah, how cute is it? Really nice. 
a really nice calendar. So yeah. And I guess day one is gonna be clearly this big bombshell fragrance. So yeah, I'm gonna find where I'm gonna put it. I don't know if I updated y'all, but I put the little gingerbread uh, towel in here. So that's cute. And y'all, the Christmas tree's up in our bedroom. I gotta decorate that. And this is the new tree. It's so pretty. It's got like the fake faux frost with the pine cones on there. That's our little thing. We gotta get some firewood, even though it's like 65 degrees, but it's so pretty. I love it. Baby looks so good on camera. All right, y'all, we're gonna go ahead and do household empties. And I'm gonna close out the vlog because it's just so long. So empty the daily balance, which is why we have to buy more today. The scent boosters as well. So this is the fabric softener. This is the scent boosters. It smells super fresh and clean. Like I said, I like to use it on Alex's clothes, you know, because I feel like my other scents are kind of floral. So I use those on him. Um, also emptied the Tidy Bowl toilet tablets. The blue, I like the blue one specifically. Also burned the Cozy Place. This was the Vanilla Orchid Bliss. This was not my favorite one. I like the Amber, Amber Woods or whatever. This one I could barely smell and it's at the end right now. So I emptied those. We also emptied the Wizard Room Mist in the scent Morning Mist. These are really good from Dollar Tree. Also emptied the Gain dryer sheet emptied the moonlit graveyard foaming um hand soap for halloween this was tombstone moss cold foggy air and eerie incense it's like a musky clean scent we like that emptied the la totally awesome base cleaner from dollar tree also emptied the gain ultra easy squeeze in the Honey berry hula scent. And then empty some cascade pods from the dishwasher. Here's one of those cozy scents. I feel like you could put like the little the little candles in there and keep the jars if you're into repurposing. And then I also emptied the gain island fresh scent. And then the OxyClean base sanitizer. Well, this is a stain remover. This one doesn't say sanitizer. I prefer the sanitizer. So yeah, that is it. Those are the household empties. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. This Thursday, we're going to do, I think, fall layering for November. So I'm going to show y'all what body combinations I've been using from shower to finish because I've been using, you know, that pumpkin pie scent and just, I have some new stuff that I haven't shown. So we're gonna do that. Then we're gonna get into the collective Christmas haul for December. So don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys this Thursday. Bye.